welcome to my channel. In this video I use paper napkins to decorate three teardrop bubbles. I will also give you some tips about gluing on round surfaces as well as what to use for gluing without wrinkles. As usual, I strongly invite you to visit my online shop for some more decoupage supplies. I will leave you the link in the description below. Now I use white paint as a base for my napkin. Remember that napkins are very thin and we need to glue them on either white or very light background. I applied one coat of paint using tapping sponge. My bulbs are drying and I can start preparing the napkin. Firstly, I remove two bottom layers leaving only top colored layer. With water and small brush I cut image into smaller pieces. It will be much easier to glue several smaller pieces on round surface instead of one large piece. Today I use varnish instead of decoupage glue to attach images to my bubbles. I highly recommend this method, but only with napkins, because they are very thin and liquid soaks through the paper working as glue. Simply apply varnish on top of the napkin, starting from the middle smoothing paper towards edges. With this method you will get little or no wrinkles on the napkins. In the meantime I fill my rope molds with paste because it takes about 24 hours to dry and I need just above two ropes for each bubble. This means it will take me over one week to create enough ropes for all my bubbles.
I use express glue to attach the ropes around the teardrops, but any quick drying glue will do the job as well. When everything is dry, I mix several paints to get dark grey shade to do some splashing. You can use either fan brush to create dots on your work or you can also use brush with stiff bristle. At this time I use brush with stiff bristle because it's easier to work around curved bobbles. I also add some water to thin my mixture a little bit. If paint is too thick, you will get large splashes instead of small dots. step would be varnishing. At this point I apply only one layer of varnish as I will be doing some more painting. My hand is always very shaky and if I make a mistake I will be able to wipe the paint off from the varnish layer. When you look at the napkin, you can see mice were hanging from branches on green ropes, but it was just easier to glue them without the rope. So now I have to paint this part myself using small brush and mix of green-black paint to match the colors. When I'm happy with the finish, I can start varnishing. I apply several layers of gloss water-based varnish around my bobbles. Then I use fine sandpaper to smooth surface of the teardrops, staying away from the rock part. Then I apply another several layers of varnish. I repeat the sanding varnishing process until the surface is perfectly smooth. There you go, my work is pretty much finished. You could maybe add some white glitter here and there if you like the bling bling. 
You don't have to use exactly the same napkin, but make sure for your first decoupage trial use white background napkin on white bobble, as this will make your life much easier. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you shortly with another video.